How's it going guys? It's Frenchie and welcome back to the channel. So we're still over here on the Ragnarok server. I've just farmed up a few bits and pieces that I need to go and tame an RG. I saw a 140 uh, around the volcano somewhere. Uh, so hopefully we can go and grab that with these dino gates and these uh, gateways. I've farmed up a few bits and pieces here in the smithy. So we've got some uh, uh, like a basic kit, basic flat kit, uh, a pistol, crossbow, etc, etc. Some bowlers, parachutes, all your kind of stuff you need. Uh, I've crafted up another metal base. Um, that I'm going to put down probably on this server. Um, I have another base already on another server, which I put put down from the last video. So that is completely hidden and off camera. I'm not going to be showing that at any point, and I'm going to basically store anything good I get in there. That's in a nice hidden spot, uh, which I might show at the end of the series uh, once the series ends. Um, we still have the PT. He's still alive, thank God. So I'm going to go over now um, to the RG. That's trolling me. <laughs> we'll go over to the RG, uh, hopefully tame him up, and hopefully get some half-decent stats, to be honest. Now right, here we go, so this is a tech dino. Oh, look at that RG there, it looks well sick. What level's that? Level 20. Damn. Where's that 140 gone? Right, level 30 tech stegos, let's kill this. This should actually give us some electronics and oil. Uh, and potentially some scrap metal. What the electronics from it, to be honest. I'm pretty sure you get more if you harvest it with a hatchet. Try not to harvest it with a PT. There we go. Oh, I only have my. I don't have a hatchet on me, I only have a pickaxe. But you get element dust out of it as well. That's handy, isn't it? Yeah, you get a lot more from with the hatchet, but oh well. 140, there it is. Nice, where well, we found it. Just double check the others. Level 20. Nice, right? Let's get this. Uh, let's get this trap somewhere. Go down here a bit. But anyway, here will be fine, I think. Just like that. Nice. Fine. Just go check these other ones, because they look pretty cool, man. Look at that guy. Level 25, lol. How about you? Level 50, damn. I want a pink one, man. They look sick. Level 50, alright, so this one here is definitely the best one. But let's get him. Get him in the trap. Oh, is this the right one? 140, yeah. I'm going to lure this other one in as well. Nice. Just make sure that there's nothing else that's going to attack it. Stay going. There's a scorpion over here. Let's just get rid of this. There'll be too many more shots now, I wouldn't think. A bit bloody. Oh, no. No. Cool, right. What'd you get? 2 1, 8 20, 5 40. That stamina's pretty high, actually, isn't it? I'm right. It's certainly not bad, anyway. It's okay. Damage okay. Yeah, it's, it's not bad all round, to be fair. Hopefully get some more points once it's tamed. Let's go get some mutton now. 
Uh, and we'll tame this guy up. Got some mutton in the end. So we managed to get a decent amount. That's enough to tame the guy up. Uh, so we look all fine to me. So I'm going to slap the meat him. See how long uh, he's got left to uh, to go. Uh, yeah, we'll check his stats and hopefully he comes out with something half decent. Nice. This guy's up then. Let's uh, see what he got. Butch. 616 on the weight. It's, it's not terrible, honestly. His health's not too bad either. 1100 stams, alright. Yeah, I'm happy with that. First RG, not too bad. Nice. They've got the RG back home. Um, I've got the metal base and a couple of extra bits and pieces in case I need to build anything else whilst I'm there. Uh, I found a little spot that is it's not a good spot by any stretch, but at the moment, like whilst I have nothing, I just want to be able to kind of farm a little bit safely. So I just want to try and go somewhere that's a little bit hidden, um, but not really. I mean, the base can be easily raided, I know that, but obviously I don't plan on having this as the main base for long. I just want to upgrade to metal so that it can't be grenade raided as easily, um, just so I can start getting a few turrets together and then obviously move the base onto something bigger and better um, over the next few hours, really. Nice, the red drops there. Check that out whilst we're here. Oh, give me a nice Fabby or something. Ooh. 8,000 euro. Oh, it's quite expensive though. 1,600 crystal. We've got a nice scuba tank though. That's decent. We'll take that. Okay, so... Yeah, this is the spot that I'm actually going to build. Um, it's got massive heat stroke right now. Um, I know it's really close to water, and yes, you could raft raid it. Yes, you could run up to it uh, and just blow in. Um, this is not supposed to be like a main base. This is just me upgrading to metal, just so it's a little bit more secure. Um, you know, so it can't be grenade raided as easily. Um, and it's slightly out of the way as well. So, you know, I'm thinking that people won't usually look here for a base. Um, or if they do look here, they know it's just going to be some little shitty new base, basically. So, yeah. If I build it a little bit over this way, I might be able to get myself a gate in here, I think. I'm thinking. Right there. Okay. Should be okay. Let's just eat some meat. I'm dying pretty quick out here. Right, let's get this fence foundation down. Right, doors. Did that just place it on the wrong side? What? Hang on. Little door. Pick up. Put it on the wrong snap frame. That's it. Is this trolling me? <laughs> there you go. Why? Why? Why did you do this to me? Let's try again. Should work. Right? Yeah. Just trolling me. There you go. Nice. Doors are doubled. Got some walls around it. Um, can I make like a hatch actually? 
That's right, yep. The trap door. I have the engram. Uh, nice. Nice, we've got that. What I'm thinking of doing is putting a fabricator um, on top of the end where the smithy's going to be instead of a ceiling. So I could put that frame. And then do is but I don't know if I want that ceiling on yet actually so I need to get the fabricated mm, the fabricated should just go down actually when I need to upgrade it yeah yeah that's fine so yeah I'll just put the ceiling back on um, when I've got the fabricator all farmed up what I'll do is have it uh, above and then I'll, I'll have the smithy here um, so then I can have the smithy there and then I'll be able to access the fabricator as well um, and then I'll probably put like a gate or something here just so I can put some tames in um, just to stop them from getting murdered by all the you know random stuff that's going to be here and uh, yeah it's, it's a little start I know it's nothing special um, but it is what it is it is what it is I can just get like a gate here um, it doesn't have to be perfect it's literally just so um, I can put the dinos somewhere where they're safe right how Luke. There we go. That'll do. That'll do. Then I can put a spike there and a spike there. <clears throat> and, uh, yeah, somewhere to eat the dinos without them getting killed. It's only very basic and bog standard. Uh, I know it's a super easy raid, but you know, for just getting started solo, it's ideal. Should be fine. Yeah, we can't walk through there. And then I'll just put another one like around here somewhere. And just Reckon about that. That looks alright, doesn't it? No, I can't go through there. Get through there, nice. Be sure someone can grapple over. Um, or even just probably jump on this. Glide suit or whatever. But I'm not caring about players getting in, it's more to keep the wild dinos out. So, uh, yeah, that'll do for now. Makeshift little dino pen. Here we go. Alright, cool. So just move the rest of the stuff out. Uh, this is what I'm bringing. So just a bit of gunpowder, an extra PT set. I found a 42 on one, so that's on this bird at the moment. Um, just a few other little bits and pieces. And yeah, we're going to move this to our other base. Um, and that's anything anything good that I accumulate during the series is going to be completely off camera. Um, so if you see things start to you know disappear from the base, that's where they're going. Um, I have no help on the server from anybody else, so I am completely solo. Nothing's being given to me, um, so it's just important to, to everyone knows that. And yeah, we do it the proper way. We do it legit. We do it solo. And uh, we have some fun at the same time, guys. Yeah, it's as far back as possible. Just made a smithy and a couple of um, pestles. There's a bit of space here. I should have put this on before I put the walls on, to be honest. That'll do. I'm losing a little bit of space, but not too much. I might be able to get another door frame here, actually. That is an airlock. Put the pestles like here. Yeah, I wonder if I've got another door frame. Okay, just chuck these this down. Airlock. 
Nice little airlock there. And we should be able to get these vessels down in here. I can get on there and place them from above, that might be better. Hmm? Nice, right. Okay, so from the top, let's try this. Yeah, look, I can, nice. Right, so if I get a couple of these in here. And a sweet spot. Like. Yeah. Maybe that's not get it. No. There we go. Do for now. I close that. Back on this guy, put him down there. There we go. There we have it. It's a tiny little base. Uh, very basic, easy to raid design, um, but super minimalistic on the resources. Um, gives me a nice little starting point. I still need to get some forges in here um, as well. So hopefully I can get a forge here. I'm not too sure though. If not, then I'm gonna have to put some forges around the back. Um, I can get more pestles in here for extra storage. I should be able to get two more here. Um, and yeah, it's not a bad little start to be honest. All right, let's try and find us an Anki now then. Microraptors. I want to tame a bunch of Microraptors as well. Um, I just need some rare flowers because they tame like within a, like, literally a minute or two. Uh, and they're super underestimated, honestly. Like having a couple of decent Microraptors when they're mate boosted, they can actually do so much damage. They're like one of the best things to counter golems if they're if someone's trying to golem soak against you. Um, so yeah, super super decent team to get. I want to get a Thyla as well, just because going out griefing on a Thyla is always nice to be able to get around the map on. I mean, it's it's not quite the best Dino anymore, um, but it's certainly handy to have. Um, and you can get some awesome colours as well. I'm all about them colours right now. <laughs> this is another good thing about having this base spot. It's actually quite near to all the red drops, so I can actually get get all of the uh, the loot. Electric prod. <laughs> well, it'll, it'll work once, you know, why not? It's better than not having a weapon, isn't it? Oh my god, man, look at that Anki. You wouldn't be able to hide on that. Level 15, oh damn. <laughs> that is the most colourful dino I think I've ever seen. It's to be up there. Oh no, there's someone's little base down there, look. Almost smashed up. They've got a forge down there, might even be able to use that. Yeah, there's no turrets or anything. Oh, let's have a little look. Oh my days, man. Look at all this gear in here. 41 metal walls. Wow, flowers as well. I needed them. Oh my god, dude. Jackpot. Where the fuck is this? Right, I'm just going to run away with this stuff now then. There's so much gear in here. Like, let's load this up and get out. There you go. Right, I got the walls. Silence up that. Take them mushrooms. Ooh, what shield BP is that? That's pretty trash, but it's cheap. Fabricator. Bunch of charcoal. Get all of this. This hide and oil. I'll take it all. I can't believe this is all just sitting here undefended like this. Hello? 
I mean, someone could come at any second. I need to be careful, but... A bit random having all this stuff just right here in the open. Bunch of charcoal. I can't believe that. Nothing in there. All that charcoal and flint. In under the foundations, any sleepers or anything? I don't think so. I think I actually know who this actually is as well. That's the funny thing. <laughs> I think I've met this person before in game. I feel like if this who if this is who I think it is, but I don't even feel bad. Forty one metal walls when you're solo, you cannot say no to that. <laughs> Lol. Right, let's try and find an Anki and let's get the fuck out, man. Oh sweet, so we just got back to base, and this is what we managed to grab out of that uh, grab out of that in the end. So. 600 pearls, 680 pearls even, uh, a little bit of crystal, some oil, um, gas, we've got a Twets, uh platform saddle which we might use, a bit of metal, 41 metal walls though, that's the jackpot right there, for a solo player getting 41 metal walls uh, on your foot, oh, well this is technically the second day now because I just woke up, um, but yeah, what an absolute result that is. To make things better, there's two micro raptors right there, and uh, gonna tame them. There you Okay. I don't have my crosshair on, so I can't really see where I'm shooting. Damn it. Oh, hit it, nice. Yeah, boy. Right, where's me, me, uh, me rare flowers? I need to get a couple of dodos as well, so I, just so I can start uh, capitalizing from the breeding event that's currently going on. I think they're dropping, like... I need to read up on it to be honest, I'm not sure exactly what it is, but I think they drop like things that help you tame stuff. Um, so I need to understand that a bit more. Um, but yeah, these Microraptors, honestly, they're so strong. Like for base defense and even now griefing, because the best way to deal with these um, is you... There you go, insta-tamed. You literally um, put your other tames on ignore whistle groups, and then you can put these on aggressive. Um, high targeting range. So let's have a look. So yeah, behavior. Um, you want this chain? No, you want that one on. Um, you want targeting, targeting. I can't even speak. Targeting distance on high, um, and then you want it on uh, aggressive. But then what you do is you you pick him up, obviously. Now he sits on your shoulder, um, and then you can like if you double tap F. Or throw him. And then if you press comma, okay, come back. <laughs> yeah, if you press comma, it will basically attack a target. Um, so if you're fighting someone, then uh, yeah, you throw at them, they like throw on a golem or something, and then sweet, there we go. Well, I'm gonna go and get an Anki. I'm gonna be ending the episode here. I'm super happy with what I managed to grab in regards to the walls and that. I might end up demolishing half of them to get the resources back and building something else. But that's going to go a long way into helping me get another base set up on a different server. Um, just so I can have three different bases on um, three different servers. Um, so yeah, it's, it's going pretty well guys. We need to get the Anki, get the farm on the go. Um, but things are looking up, honestly. Um, I hope you're enjoying the series so far, guys. Um, if you do, don't, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.